Glad to have you with us in the studio. I'm Reese Davis, bringing you the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 pregame show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. West Point, New York, home of the oldest military post in America, becomes the scene as we prepare for what should be a football war. The kicker's got the ball set up, and we're ready to get this thing started. He just drills this one. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Army's offense really centered around this quarterback, and as he goes, the team seems to go, Kirk. Brad, over the weeks, I've been watching him on film, and one thing I've seen is his ability to make good decisions. I mean, time after time, he just avoids the mistakes. And when you can do that as a quarterback and as a leader of an offense, you're going to move the football down the field. And now he pitches it. Knocked out of bounds at the 37. He's going to get some congratulations for that nice display of running. Normally, his job is to block. He tackles him for a loss. The halfback took the pitch but couldn't find any running lanes. And there were no running lanes because this defense had so much penetration into the backfield. He would have been lucky to get back to the line of scrimmage. From their own 36-yard line, it's second down. Complete. He's hit hard. That's a nice six-yard game. He got just a little bit of separation from the defender, and that was enough room for him to make the catch. Caught, and he's hit immediately. The defense was ready for that pass and catch, and they did a good job to hold them for such a short game. Patrick is waiting for the snap. Flag down, and I'm not sure First when it saw. was thrown. Let's Clicking. find out. Receiving, Receiving team. team. You're always looking for the home run return. The big highlight didn't happen there, but he still got him a couple yards. First down, 10 to go. Ball on their own 29. Positive yardage. That makes it second and six. And he's tackled at the 48 yard line. Nothing tentative on that run at all. He looked very determined and got the first down. Open man, quick strike, and he can't pull it in. From their own 48-yard line, second down. Gets it out to his receiver in a hurry. He's tackled at about the 35. First down. Complete and taken down immediately. Anderson makes the tackle with the 30 yard line. That brings him second and five.
that'll bring him down at the 31-yard line. He wasn't decisive at all on that option. And once he kept it himself, there was no place to go. So they're going to go for it here. Under heavy pressure. And they'll take over on downs. They've got to play with some focus and smarts here. They don't want to make a mistake and suddenly find themselves trailing. And down he goes at about the 31. The Black Knights have one of the most dangerous offensive weapons in the entire country under center today. This kid is really fun to watch. He's fun to watch unless you're a defensive coordinator. One thing's for sure, it's going to be a great chess match between the offensive and defensive coordinators today. Nice run there. Five yards there for the quarterback. King on play action. And he's taken down around the 39-yard line. That'll make it fourth and two. Lee, back to return it. And down he goes at the 33-yard line. I don't think either team has a clear advantage so far. Let's see if they can make some plays and get a little separation. Now he's scrambling. Quarterback's going to run it, and he's got room to work. Slides down to the ground. Call it a gain of nine yards. That brings up second and one. And they get him in the backfield for a loss. So they wrapped him up before he could get anything going. Yeah, there was nothing there on that option. From their own 38-yard line, it's third down. Well, after that injury, we'll get to see the backup quarterback here. Fires that quickly, incomplete. Boy, that hurts the offense to have to go three and out. They're going to have to think about how to get something going the next time they come out. It's away. Short punt. Let's get some points going right now. Not a lot of offense here in the opening quarter. I'm with you. I'd like to see a lot more offense than we've seen up to this point. Give credit to the defenses, but I think you're going to see both these offense coordinators get more of a feel for things and start to adjust their play call. And so far, it's been totally even. In close games like this, every possession is likely to matter. And they make the stop at the 33. He's taken down around the 44-yard line. So at the end of one, no score here. And we welcome you back to the action here. Just about set to start the second quarter. Now he pitches it. Tackled after a decent pickup. the 48. That's a 
gain of one on the play. That'll bring up third and two. He makes it to the 48-yard line. No game. Fourth down. The Blue Devils quarterback, we saw him taken out earlier down there on the sideline after being injured. I don't think he's in that much pain right now, though, and I would bet that he'll be back in the game before the day's done. Gets to about the 24-yard line. They've been like a couple of fighters feeling each other out so far. Let's see if they start to open it up a little bit more now. Wide open, and he just drops it. That makes it second and ten. Second down, ten to go. Ball on the 24-yard line. Throws in the middle. Tackle made at the 37-yard line. That makes it first and ten. He's under some heat. Decides to tuck it in, and he's got space. Slides down. That's good for a gain of eight yards. That makes it second and two. Got a receiver, and he dropped it. It's third down, and they're about two yards shy of the sticks. Brought down around the 41-yard line. That's not what you hope for from your running game. You're looking for some solid north and south progress. You never want to give the defense a play like that to build their confidence. Carter is the punter. This is the point in the game where you don't want to make any mistakes that give the other guys a reason to feel more confident going into halftime. Ladder's back. He makes it out to maybe the 36-yard line. He's lucky just to get back to the line of scrimmage on that option. That makes it second and ten. He gets out to about the 44-yard line. Gets to about the 44-yard line. That'll make it fourth and two. Duke's going to use their first time out of the half here. Patrick awaits the snap. He's tackled at the 25-yard line. Some great defense so far in this one, Parker. Yeah, no doubt about that. The defense has been dominant. I think the offenses now need to take advantage of some time to make adjustments and see if they can get things turned around. You always want to go in the locker room with momentum, so as we get closer to halftime, I think we'll see more and more attempts to create big plays. Throws it deep. <laughs> And he's hit immediately. So on first down, they go to the air and pick up huge yardage. Well, that was just a well-executed play. They picked a perfect time to stretch the defense with a passing play, and it worked. Quick throw. 
And he's tackled at the 17. They went back to the same play that time. Yeah, you're right. Same play as the one before, and they got a good completion and a nice gain. From the 17-yard line, first down. And they'll bring him down behind the line. More plays like this, and the coaching staff is going to need to change up the blocking schemes. You can't allow the defense to play in your backfield. Strike to his receiver, no good. These receivers need to be ready because he's capable of really launching some passes. That one was just out of reach. From the 19-yard line, third down. He unloads it. Duke is looking to go up by three. Kicks up, and it sails through the uprights. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. Excellent kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. He's tackled at the 39-yard line. Bring him down around the 49-yard line. Very solid gain through the air. I'm impressed with the poise of this quarterback and the ability of the receiver to keep his concentration and get his hands on the football. Short yardage situation here. It's second down and one. Throws complete. He's got space to work. And down he goes at the 46. First down there on a five-yard pass. This quarterback still hasn't missed a receiver on this drive. Scrambling around. And they bring him down for a sack on the play. You have to keep an eye on this guy, especially during passing situations, because he does a great job of getting to the quarterback, as we saw right there. Slings it to his fullback, and he's taken down at the 46-yard line. That brings us to the Big hit there to stop him. These special teams have done it before, blocking punts. It looks like they're coming after this one. So we've played two quarters. Duke leads 3-0. Hi, everybody. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. This is Davis, David Pollock here in the studio as always to lend a little perspective to what just went down in the first 30 minutes. Both of these defenses are opportunistic and very good at forcing turnovers. But both quarterbacks, David, have done a very good job while trying to maintain an aggressive mindset they haven't forced the ball. The runners have done a good job keeping it put away. Yeah, and as much as you preach that all throughout the week, it's still hard to do. It's hard to execute. And being able to see what you see on the defensive side of the football and adjust to it offensively, how about protecting the quarterback so he's not getting hit from the blind side, fumbling the football, ball carriers running with the football, keeping it tight to their body, not giving it away. So 
you know, between running backs, receivers, and quarterbacks, offensive linemen blocking, did a great job executing on the offensive side of the football, not to create, not to give away any turnovers. Just about ready to start the second half. We're going to watch all the games around the country, including some coaches who like to sample the surface that they're playing on. I'll, I'll keep an eye on that. Yeah, I'm going to go to the cafeteria. You want some turf? Some Asher turf or anything? Yeah, if they've got some, I'll chew on that in the second half. Here's the second half for you to chew on with Brad and Kirk. Lee from the eighth. Tackle at the 30 yard line. Both squads are digging in now. Let's see what happens on this next drive. Duke is up by three. And they make the stop around the 40 yard line. First down. Fires out to his receiver. You know what? After a play like that, I wouldn't be the least bit surprised if they went to the air again. He takes it right side for a good game. So the option play works as designed, and the offense picks up a first down. Good read by the quarterback. He made a quick pitch off to the running back, and they came away with a pretty good game. Quick throw out to the receiver, incomplete. That makes it second and ten. From the 48-yard line, second down. but he's tackled back behind the line of scrimmage. And they'll lose a yard there. Really, they just had nowhere to go after the catch. Here they come. Has time. Wants to throw outside. And they couldn't hook up on that one. Good push here by the pass rush. They keep harassing this quarterback like that. And they'll create some mistakes. Everybody up close. It looks like they're coming after this kick. He's pushed out of bounds around the 29-yard line. This deficit can be easily overcome, sure. But they have to be thinking if they don't get something going on this series, the burden is going to be felt by their defense. And he hits him hard at the 28. They'll lose a yard on that quarterback keeper. from their own 28-yard line. Second down. Throws complete. He's got room to work. So they get about four yards from play action. That makes it third and seven. A complete to the halfback over the middle. He's taken down around the 34 yard line. At the 34 yard line. That'll bring up fourth and five. Patrick to punt. Lee fields it at the 34. He makes it out to maybe the 49 yard line. Their last drive broke down, and they punted. What do they have in store this time out? In the shotgun and five wideouts. Hey! 
throws incomplete. And there wasn't anyone in the vicinity. I think the ball just slipped out on them. That makes it second and ten. From their own 49-yard line, it's second down. Duke holds a field goal lead. He makes the catch and has a first down. Has it to the senior. Gain of 12 yards. First down. They go with a run, and he brought down in the backfield. One-yard loss for the halfback. He's hit and taken down. Throws middle to the tight end. Gain of six yards. That'll make it 35. throws it away. You know, when you feel pressure like that, the worst thing you want to do is just to throw the ball into coverage. He got away with one right there. He's very fortunate. Next time, he should just throw it away out of bounds. It's fourth down, and the offense is getting set to go for it. Zips it to the back. Got an opening. He gets hit out of bounds around the 21-yard line. First down. He might have a chance. Big play there, and now they're looking at first and goal. Call the game of 16 yards. That makes it first and goal. Duke has a three-point lead. They'll get him for a loss. This is the 10th play of this drive. A well-deserved score. And he tacks on the extra point. So a 10-play, 50-yard drive, and that's good for a touchdown. Fred, I thought the offense did a really nice job of mixing up the play calling on that drive. I thought the defense was on its heels most of the drive because of the versatility of the offense. He's to the 20. And down he goes at the 24-yard line. The Blue Devils continue to get it done on the defensive side of the football, Kirk. Yeah, they've done a good job of building this lead and almost determined here to protect it. Let's see if they can hold on here for the rest of the way. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. Ready, ride, set, ride. Tackle right around the 34. Makes his way to about the 42. That's good for a game of eight yards. That makes it second and two. He's at midfield. He's at the 40. Inside the 30. And they bring him down at the 22. When you combine his speed as a runner with the strength of the offensive line, you have the potential for some long runs. Right, right, right. 
gives it to the back. Tackle made at about the 13. So at the end of the third quarter, the Blue Devils in front, 10-0. All right, we're just about set to start action here again in the fourth quarter. He gets to about the five. Nine. That's not what you hope for from your running game. You're looking for some solid north and south progress. You never want to give the defense a play like that to build their confidence. That brings up a second and goal. Ball on the nine-yard line. And he tackles him hard at the six-yard line. Gain of three on the play. That makes it third and goal. There's a strike complete, and they hit him in the backfield. That'll be a loss of one. They really just didn't have any room to work on that play. The defense just suffocated them there. So the offense stays on the field to attempt this fourth down from the six-yard line. given the circumstances. They just couldn't pull it off. Both teams are well aware that a score on this drive is going to create an almost insurmountable lead. This defense has really got to step it up and make a stop. And he makes it out to about the eight-yard line. to the receiver. Good open field tackle. Timmons makes the tackle at the 17-yard line. Third down. tackled at the 30. So he keeps it and he gets a big first down. The quarterback made a very good decision here not to pitch. He saw a break in the defense and just hit it for a big game. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 30. Nice run there. White gains around six yards on the run. Army will take their first time out of the half. A little more than two minutes to go in the fourth quarter. Army's going to have to use their second time out of the half. Third down again. Now he's scrambling. The Black Knights using their third and final timeout. Williams, the return man. And he 
he's tackled at the 34-yard line. Well, these defensive coaches have got to be loving what they've seen from their guys today. Well, you and I talked to both of these coordinators getting ready for this game, and they put together a game plan. They shared it with us, and we're seeing it out there on the field today. They still are going to determine the outcome of this game. They're set to go for another round. He airs it out. Inside the 30. He's tackled at the 25-yard line. Yard line. Curtis picks up around five yards with that catch. That brings him second and five. From the 20 yard line, it's second down. Defense has had two stops already down here. Crosses short over the middle to his fullback. And down he goes at the 16. Less than two minutes in the fourth quarter. Pulls it in, and he's in the open field. And he can't stay in bounds, but they'll have it first and goal. It's first down, and they'll be looking for six points here. Quick throw. They'll bring him down just outside the goal line. Taken down at the three-yard line. Big play here for both teams. It's third and goal from the two. Got to be careful of a pass play with this defense. He laterals the ball. And they make the stop at the one-yard line. That's a gain of two on the play. That brings us to the goal. Check four, check four. So a fourth down stop there late in the fourth quarter, and that should do it. And so now the ball's turned over on downs. take over here, ready to start a new series. Tackled after a decent pickup. That's good for a gain of four yards. That makes it second and six. Second down. They're deep in their own territory. This one's in the books. The Blue Devils get the victory. 10-0. Ten ten. That brings this broadcast to a close. For EA Sports and Kirk Herb Street, I'm Brad Nessler. We'll see you soon for another edition of NCAA Football 14.